If you're tired of presenting your data in a boring, unengaging way, you want to stand out from the crowd and captivate your audience. But most importantly, start ranking on the first page of Google with the greatest hack ever. Look no further. Infographics is the answer for you. People absolutely love them. They love to save them. They love searching by them. And guess what? Google loves them also. So in this video, I'm going to show you step by step how to create the most engaging and the most visual appealing infographics ever with zero skills and of course by starting for free. So if you're ready for this, this video is for you. So the platform we're going to review together is called pick to chart It's not new, it's already trusted by millions of people. It's probably the best way to bring information to life in a beautiful visual way without having to be a designer, having any coding skills or being a professional marketeer. So you see that you can turn complex data into clear, catchy visuals like this right here or even edit videos like a text document. And everything is really drag and drop. You use templates or you start from scratch. You add elements or you edit the existing ones. And of course, you can browse the library of million different elements that you can use for in your graphics. So without further ado, let's start exploring. I will log in. So this is the dashboard. You're going to see all the templates right here. You can start exploring and see what fits your needs, especially in the infographic section. The number of different templates is endless and it's actually much more sophisticated than you're going to find in any other platform, even Canva. So check how modern and fresh they look, beautiful graphic and illustrations. And if you're struggling with a topic you want to select, you can scroll down here, select your industry. Let's say, for example, that you're in the health industry and you're going to find the most relevant infographics for your topic. If you want to write an article, for example, about summer heat exhaustion and how to protect yourself, you can use something like that. Check it out. Cool one, right? You can edit that within two, three minutes and post it on your article because Google absolutely loves them. Now you can find more infographics. So for example, the diagrams that are great for storytelling. They're amazing for marketing in order to showcase some statistics or share insights about an industry or a finding. Showcase a process like this. Design your own flow charts or even more sophisticated stuff like competitive analysis. In this template, for example, SWOT analysis, Best analysis like this and so many other. Or the pictograms that is probably one of my favorite ones, like this one, for example. How a lifetime of football can affect the brain. I'm pretty sure you've seen similar images on many popular blogs. And guess where those blogs get their infographics? From Picture Chart. Or this one from Alcohol Consumption. So many different ones that you can that you can get inspiration from. Or even use them as the first draft. Customize yours accordingly. And of course, you have more. Donut charts, pie charts, comparison infographics, like for example, the do's and don'ts or myths and facts about diets like this. So no matter what you want, just go to infographics, for example, search for tips, let's say, and you're going to get all the relevant templates that you can use for tips. So let's say, for example, that I want to use this template, right? I will hit edit. And now you're going to see how simple the interface looks. You have the graphic right here on the right. Everything is customizable. You see, I can edit every single element, change the fonts, change the colors, add different elements, design your own components like maxed photos, graphics and text, different lists, different timelines. Of course, you can choose a specific template like this and make it longer and see that, for example, if I want to add anything on that, I'll choose a photo grid, for example, and add it right here. I will adjust it. Maybe add a title right here. Change the color, of course, so it can really pop out. Make it smaller so that it fits. I will use 48. And again, you can keep going and add different elements, even maps. So let's say that I want to add Europe, for example, right here, and you can edit the data of every single country. Of course, you can add your own files and create different folders with them, different tables or even videos from YouTube. And of course, a ton of different illustrations, icons and 3D elements from the existing library so you can tell any story that you want. So let me show you how I would edit this 
If I wanted, for example, to create an article about 10 marketing tips you need to know in 2023, right? I will edit the text. I'll adjust it. Like this. You need to know 2023. Let's adjust the colors according to my brand. The eight brand colors. So you can select your branded colors and keep them in your color palette so you, can, so you don't have to do it again and again. This one may be white and maybe gray. You can upload your own brand fonts. So you see now that I have my branded colors right here ready. Maybe I will choose to change the color to black and make this, this. Change all the elements. I to delete those and add different elements search for marketing so we will add this i will follow the example of the previous template and i will add different elements like this one for example this guy making some money maybe this one generating leads and some 3d elements like that you can unleash your creativity and do whatever you feel like so i'll put the do's so here it will be my do's think strategy don'ts you can write this yourself or ask ChatGPT. right can you give me do's in your marketing strategy in 2023 Embrace personalization. Focus on user-generated content. Do optimize for voice search. Do prioritize video marketing. Do, do focus on sustainability and corporate social responsibility. Great. So you can take one by one, not them here. Do embrace personalization, right? I'll make this a bit smaller so that it fits like this and add something relevant. I'll add something like this, for example, right? And so on and so forth. You can edit every single text. You can add your elements, you can make it up to here, or you can continue maybe having a chart or some insights about, about the statistics of what people consume in 2023 in terms of mediums, and so on and so forth. You can share that with anybody, even your team members, so that they can continue editing. Or when you're ready, download, use it as a PDF or a PNG, so you can embed it on your website or your or your article. So infographics is the greatest asset to this platform, but of course, it's not the only one. You can have checklists like this, which by the way, you can sell on Etsy. Many people want to buy that stuff. You can customize your own and sell them as a digital product. Build your email signature, which is a brand new feature. Create your logo from the existing templates. Create brochures, social media content and elements like Facebook covers, Instagram stories, Instagram posts, different certificates and invitations, so many other stuff that it's worth exploring. You can even explore the pic to chart video feature that allows you to edit different videos based on the transcript. So you see that it transcribes a specific video and you can edit by minute the things that you want to cut out and it will edit accordingly your video. This makes video editing so much easier. So let's say that, for example, you want to export a specific section from your video. You export the section and that's it. You can adjust your videos as well for different usages on social media, to square, horizontal or vertical. But this function for me is the most important one. So many times I create a video and it's really difficult for me to edit and remove the spots that I want to take out. With pick to chart you can remove entire sections like this. Boom. Or select specific lines like this and add a visual. So let's say that I want to add this one. The visual is added to the specific section that you chose, like this. Great, right? And when you're done, export and you're good to go. Now, I'm sure you're curious about that. So I will tell you that you can start for free, as I said at the beginning. You have the free plan, which of course comes with limitations. You get five visuals, two downloads, and 20 minutes of video for free, forever. But if you wanna do much more work and use it for your clients or your agency, or your freelance career or whatever, you can check my link in the description so you can have a discount on the annual plan. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, show some love. Hit the like and subscribe button because the next video that is coming will break YouTube, I promise. You might want to watch this video, and until next time, simply hustle.